What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Persona 4. Hopefully there isn't too big of a gap between part 48 and today's part, part 49. In the last episode, really only eventful thing that I could think of was starting our job at the hospital, which we are going to continue today at this municipal hospital. What a fun job. Look at that. We're cleaning windows. Amazing. Who wouldn't want to clean windows in the middle of the night? Oh great, this is gonna be one of those spooky things. It oh well I got courage. But it's like we're playing like five nights at Freddy's or something. <laughs> like oh shit, no. It's not some giant teddy bear monster, it's just a doctor and a nurse. That's that's much better actually. Why is he whispering? what's what's he hiding? Some this is this is a sketch fest right here. <laughs> Something sketchy. They're scheming. Oh, you're cute. You're the student who started working here today, right? I'll show you something fun the next time you're here. I'll see you again. Wait, did we even start our job here last time? No, I think we just picked up the job and this is our first time. And now this nurse sees us and she wants all up on that dick. Okay. Whatever, man. That's kind of weird. Like she said, you're a student. Like, am I underage in this game or nah? <laughs> I can't remember if like a character's like 17 or 18 or what, but like, there's potential issues with age of consent in there, I'm sure. So this nurse, this nurse better back off or something. I don't know. I don't give a fuck. Look at that. We just stood there looking at ourselves. Looking at how beautiful we are. Well. Now it schools out. I don't know what to do. I, yeah, let's just jump off the roof, actually. Because, um... If all I'm doing is school and working at a hospital, I'd say this is probably the best option. Just to end it all right here. I could probably climb the fence. Oh no, we're going into town. Or right, we gotta run some errands before we do it. Alright, that's fair. What is that noise? I keep hearing noises in my house and it kind of creeps me out. It's not nighttime, it's 2.37 in the afternoon, but like, just random noises creep me out. That's always been one issue with me. Like, I get paranoid over random noises. Like, every house makes those noises. No matter how old your house is, it's still gonna have creaks and cracks and shit. But I digress. Let's run these errands. Let's get something to eat. Let's get prepared for a long night at the hospital. Damn, we're eating that. He was going to town on that. I'm sure I've mentioned this before, but I love how just, like, eating a meal increases your understanding. Like, damn, there must be some philosophical restaurants we're going to. Wow, we come home, she's like, welcome back, and then immediately I head to the hospital. See, this is what capitalism does to families. <laughs> okay. Alright, so now we're getting into the nitty gritty of it. Before we were just out there cleaning windows, first day on the job, they probably got you training, all that good stuff. Now they got you working. Oh wow, our courage grew to brave. Nice. I'm sure that unlocks a lot of stuff. Makes us able to say the more ridiculous answers in the game. The, on the dialogue choices, we could say shit nice like, work. eat my ass. I'm Sayoko Uehara. Nice to meet you. Why do they like purposely try to make her voice as seductive as possible? We get it. She's a cougar. We don't need you making the game even more awkward. <laughs> oh shit. What the fuck? Your skin is so smooth. 
Uh, yeah, I think I'm picking up what you're laying down. Holy fuck. Now nah, that man will see. You see that? That was Kenny. He's gonna see it. Wait, what is she even talking about? <laughs> Damn. Damn. This nurse wants that dick. So you're telling me we get a social link for letting some woman hit on us while we awkwardly stand there. You know, this is honestly, I've said this before in the series, but this is a really accurate real life simulator. This really speaks to my life, just on a deep personal level. Wait, is the devil arcana? That, that was kind of scary, it was like, you got the devil arcana, like, Whoa, back off. Anyways, that was interesting. And we got, we picked up some money. We got, we got a woman interested in us. And we got 5,000 yen. So I'd say it's a good night. Oh, a night on call well spent. Yeah. It would have been spent better not working, of course. But. Wait, does that say it's fucking Saturday? Oh yeah, I forgot Japanese people go to school on Saturdays. Man, that's fucked. Fucked up. Yo, what's good, GA? Looking like the fucking grandpa with the gray hair. Oh wait, no, that's me. Shit. Yo, GA fucking roasted me. Yo, there's that fox. Oh shit, we're going to All the right, TV. It's time, boys. It's the moment you've all been waiting for. Alright, Teddy, we're gonna search for Kanji. But I want you to shut up. Don't speak the entire time. Alright? That's the deal. Had enough of your shit, Teddy. I haven't complained about you for a few episodes, but just looking at you reminded me you're an annoying ass character, man. And we are back to doing my favorite activity in this game, just walking through dungeons. Uh, trying to avoid as many enemies as possible. And uh, then getting into like three minute battles with said enemies. Holy shit, man, did you see that? He was crawling after us. He wasn't running after us, he was crawling after us. That enemy, he was army crawling. I mean, I know he doesn't have legs, so it's kind of his only option, but still. There's some dangerous people down here. Or, not people, uh. Just dangerous every this place is dangerous, very dangerous. I wouldn't I wouldn't go here. But like who would walk in here? You'd have to have some serious balls. Especially knowing that there is like a huge faggot at the end. Yeah, I don't know where I'm going to be honest. This place is confusing as all hell. Oh, he's gonna get pumped up! Oh man, he's get Teddy's gonna smash this shit. Calm down, Teddy. Don't hurt us. Oh man. Did Teddy just go beast mode? Is Teddy the beast in the booth? Oh man, we're about to get cornered by these enemies. Run, man. Run with that big ass sword of yours. But don't run with scissors. It'll stab your eye out. Or shoot your eye out or something. Oh, 
we getting close? Where, where's the rest of my people? Where's Teddy? Where's Where's that boy? I know I don't want to hear him, but like, if he's gonna tell me where Kanji is, I'll let him speak. I bet he's right in here. Yep. Thank you, Teddy. We're going in, boys. We're gonna take him on in the next episode. So we're gonna save the game and invite the faggot.